Our big story at 5.30. Fox 35 is investigating the record of the man accused of driving drunk with a school bus full of kids. Deputies say his blood alcohol content was four times over the legal limit. Fox 35 learned Mark McNeil was cited just three days earlier for another crash in a school bus. And as Dave Puglisi reports, the charges against this driver are really piling up. Mark McNeil is now up to 14 felony counts of child neglect, and another 11 are pending. Today, we try to get his side of the story. Mark McNeil is out on bond and on paid administrative leave from his job as a Flagler County school bus driver. The 60-year-old is accused of driving a school bus drunk with 40 kids on board. Inside his Ormond Beach home, muffled voices could be heard. But after multiple attempts, no one came to the door. Fox 35 obtained McNeil's employment history, which showed he's been driving for the county since 2017. His most recent evaluation, conducted in February of 2020, showed no cause for concern, stating McNeil exhibits the necessary proficiencies to perform quality work. Although later that year, he was reprimanded for leaving a sleeping child on the bus. Then just this past Monday, he was involved in a school bus accident, where he was cited by the Florida Highway Patrol for running a stop sign. I kept repeating, um, I got in a bad accident on Monday, and he just kept repeating that. We have a lot of questions for the district, including how they handled McNeil's accident and why they didn't call 911 when they received word that McNeil could be drunk. Supervisors that tried to stop him, good job. The only thing I wish they would have done sooner was call us. We reached out to Flagler County Schools as well as multiple school members. All of them declined comment until they finish their internal investigation, which could happen sometime next week. Dave Puglisi, Fox 35 News.